Hi beauty bees, welcome back to my channel. In today's video, we're gonna be doing this Lady Gaga stupid love inspired look. Halloween is just around the corner and I know a lot of you want some good looks and I figured this is a really easy and simple way to get started. And I pretty much used a lot of affordable products for this. So I'll go ahead and list below what I used. And if you really want this look, then go ahead and keep watching. Hello, mwah. So to get started today, we're gonna go ahead and use the Think Me Later eyeshadow primer. And then I'm gonna go in with my Tarte Concealer Shape Tape, and it's in medium, and I'm putting that again all over my eyelid and on the bottom as well. Next, I'm taking my Morphe X Jeffree Star Palette, and I'm going in with the color Self Made, and I'm just gonna put that all over my lid as well as drag it all the way up to my brow. And I'm kind of creating a little, um, I guess, angle on the side towards my brow, as you see. And I'm gonna put that as well on the bottom lash line. Next, I'm gonna go in with the color back, and I'm gonna put that all over where I put the self-made. Because Gaga's look is more of like a bubblegum pink, I'm just gonna keep applying it until I get it to the desired level of pink. Now I'm taking my Clinique eyeliner, and this is in 01 Black, and I'm gonna create my cat eye. Next, I'm taking my Morphe M562 brush, and I'm dipping it in Fast Lane, and I'm gonna go ahead and put the black, but it's only gonna be in this outer kind of crease, and I'm dragging it up like in a um, kind of curved line, as you see, towards my brow, and I'm only keeping it right there um, in that outer V, as well as make sure that the black is very pigmented. So I'm just gonna keep going in until I get the desired pigment. And with this Anastasia brush, I'm also gonna dip it in the fast lane and then just kinda put a little bit more pigment in that black by packing it in. Taking my Lanch Curler and I'm gonna put my Milk Kush Mascara on. And while I'm waiting for that to dry, I'm gonna go ahead and put a little bit of pink on my eyebrows because that's how she has it in the picture. So I'm using my Kylie Jenner Lips um, Lip Liner and I think it's Spice, but I'll list it below. And I'm putting that all over my brow as well as going in with the um, Morphe Star palette with Self Made and back and just kind of putting that in there as well. Now I'm gonna go in with my Blinking Beaut eyelashes and these are the genius ones but they're the half lashes. I got these on sale at Ulta and they're 21 days of beauty. I do, I do really love these lashes. Anyways, I'm just putting it on the outer corner and this helps give the almond illusion of my eye like she has. And using this balloon weight thingy I found at the dollar store, I used this pink material to create the sticker that she has on her outer corner. And pretty much what I did was I just took a piece of fabric, measured it, and then kind of tr and then put that material on it and traced it and to make that sticker. Super easy, <laughs> literally a dollar at the dollar store. And I used glitter glue to stick it on there. Now I'm gonna deepen my contour just a little bit more. And now I'm going in with my lips and I'm using Dose Pinky Promise. And I'm not using a liner, so I'm just kind of using that felt little tip to line it as precisely as I can. Next, I'm gonna take this highlighter from the Carly Bible palette, and I'm gonna put that all over my Cupid's bow and then kind of blend it out. And she has this like little mole on one side of her um, eyes. I don't know which one, but I used my Anastasia brow pen just to kind of put it on there. And then I finished the eye look with the Milk Kush Mascara, putting it on my bottom lashes and just kind of blending it with the um, lashes that I put on. 
and I'm taking this milk blush and I'm putting it all over my cheeks and I'll list the one that it is below. Next I'm taking this powder, it's, it's a uh, banana sitting powder and this is just to help brighten my eye. So it's like a yellow pigment, it just kind of helps brighten my eye. So I got this beautiful pink ponytail at the beauty store, um, the wig beauty store for $13 literally synthetic but you know it's pretty worth it $13 for this pony that's freaking awesome so I just put my hair in a bun just kind of this messy bun nothing special take some of those flyaways and clip them up together and there it has these little combs so see them on the top and the bottom and this little drawstring so what you're gonna do is you're gonna put that comb on the top and shove it in there shove the one in the back and then you're gonna pull that draw drawstring and draw drawstring and then I kind of wrap it around just to get it a little more tight and I put a bobby pin underneath to pull it and then I'm gonna take like a piece of the hair and I'm gonna wrap it all around the bun kind of to give it that illusion that um, it has like a kind of ponytail holding it up So that is the hair done and I kind of have been like experiencing a lot of hair loss lately. Ugh, I think I'm balding. So I took my BH brow palette and I'm just kind of going over my hairline just to kind of make it look a little more even and not as patchy and baldy because unfortunately I turned 30 and I'm losing all my hair guys. Mm, sucks. Sucks so much. But anyways. Um, using the same thing that I got from the doll store, I took one of those little stars off and she has like a heart, but I'm just gonna make this kind of my own look. So I put a star on my forehead and I took these little things also, I kind of plucked them from there. And I'm gonna use that to create that little like Sailor Scout thing that she has on her. I call it a Sailor Scout thing. It's like a little, little crown thing, but it, she, literally, she literally looks like a Sailor Scout, which, which is why I really love this look. And I am kind of just measuring these and I'm using eyelash glue to apply them to my forehead and I'm just putting about three of them on one side and then I'm gonna do the same on the other and I'm just kind of cutting them as I stick them on my head um, and I'm doing the same for the other side kind of like oh, oh I'm missing 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 <laughs> and uh, just doing that I keep missing every time I try to use these dang scissors if you see me I'm just like oh miss miss <laughs> because I'm using the camera as a mirror, which I should not be doing. But that's why I'm not looking directly at the camera. Anyways, like I said, lash glue, and I just kind of use that to create this. Okay, so this is literally the final result. I really hope you enjoyed this video. Please hit the subscribe button and hit that bell. I really feel like a superhero, and I feel like I should have my own comic book. Ooh, yeah. Anyways. Um, thank you so much for watching. I really hope you enjoyed this Lady Gaga inspired look. And just remember, you are beautiful and worth it. Bye.